In case you didn't already know, having your own email list full of targeted leads is the holy grail when it comes to your online business and its ability to generate revenue from promoting and selling your products and your services. Simply put, it's the heart and soul of any business, any great online business. So what I wanna do for you in this video is share with you why building an email list is so important and also show you how I use YouTube in order to collect email subscribers every single day so that you can do the exact same thing for your business. Let's dive in. And thank you for stopping by on my channel. If you are a returning viewer, then thank you so much for coming back and watching more of my content. I appreciate every single one of you. And if this is your first time here, my name is Ryan Ford and I teach online coaches and course creators how to scale their sales while working less. Now, what I want to share with you in this video is how I am able to grow my email list every single day using YouTube and to also break down why growing your email list is so important for you and for your business. It's the most important thing that you can do if you want to build a business online that continues to grow and generate revenue for you over time. So that is what we are going to be talking about today. Now, just before we begin, I also wanna give you something else on top of this video that is going to help you tremendously with building your own online business inside of the digital product or the coaching space. I wanna give you a completely free copy of my digital creator startup guide, which is a downloadable guide that I created, which will show you in a simple step-by-step -step fashion how to build your own online business in the space of digital products or coaching services. It's packed with helpful information and it's completely free. It doesn't cost you anything. So if you are interested in that, you can get your hands on the guide by clicking the link. It should be somewhere up here on your screen now and also down below in the video description. Okay, now let's move on and talk about growing your email list. Let me start off by telling you why you need an email list to build a successful business. An email list is a list of email addresses that you own. It's basically a direct link, a direct form of communication that you have between yourself and the person whose email address that you have. The reason why this is so important to have is because it's something that you own. It's something that nobody else can take away from you. It's yours. I've seen a huge trend in recent years in which people who own online businesses are focusing on building a huge following on social media, which isn't a problem if that's what you want to do, but it becomes a problem if you do this without realizing that you do not own that following. You do not and will never own that audience, and your ability to contact that audience is controlled by the platform that you have built that audience on. So you can have 100,000 followers on Instagram, but that doesn't mean that each of those 100,000 followers will see each of your posts. You could have 100,000 subscribers here on YouTube, but each time you post a new video, that doesn't mean that those 100,000 subscribers will see your new video, even if they are subscribed to you and to your channel. And the reach is different for each platform, but at their core, they are all controlled by an algorithm that decides who gets to see your content and who doesn't. It's completely out of your control. Now, if you have 100,000 email list subscribers, when you send out an email to your list, all 100,000 of those people will receive the email that you send out. Every single one of those 100,000. Now, of course, some people will miss your email, some people won't open your email, some of those emails will end up in spam, but 100% of your list will have been sent an email from you. There isn't a social media platform in existence that can give you that amount of control over your audience. Now, another great ability that comes from your email list is because you have the ability to send out an email to your entire list whenever you see fit, this also gives you the ability to predict how much income that you can make whenever you send out an offer or you launch a new product. Because based upon the size of your list, you can roughly estimate how many sales you are going to generate because you know that everybody on your list is going to receive the email that you send. And that's something that you will never be able to estimate on social media because that's completely random and determined by a robot or an algorithm that you have zero control over. The way to estimate this using email is to use the industry standard conversion rate. In my experience, you should be aiming to make a 1% conversion rate. So that means each time that you promote a product or a service to your email list, you should be aiming to convert 1% of the people on your email list into a paying customer. And of course, this isn't set in stone. You can get higher conversion rates if you have a very engaged list and you can get lower conversion rates if you have a very... But as an average, you should be aiming to convert 
at 1%. So this means if you have 100 email subscribers on your list, you can expect to make one sale of your product. If you have 1000 email subscribers on your list, you can expect to make 10 sales of your product and so on and so on. So if you have an upcoming, let's say online course launch or a new group coaching program or a new membership site that you want to launch or whatever product you are about to launch, based upon the size of your email list, this conversion rate will give you a rough idea of how many sales you are going to make and how much revenue this particular launch is going to generate for you and your business. Something that you would never be able to do if you are promoting to a following on social media. And I should also mention, if you build up a huge following on social media and you don't have an email list of those followers, you and your business are completely at the mercy of that platform. If it was to be banned, for example, like TikTok has just been threatened with in the US, or if the account was hacked and then banned from that platform, your entire business would die in a heartbeat. You would lose your entire audience and you would have to start all over again from scratch. That's not something you should gamble with, especially if your business is your livelihood. I mean, if that happened to you and your business was the way that you support yourself and your family, what would you do? What could you do? Nothing, you could do absolutely nothing. You'd lose your living and you would have to start all over again. Now I've heard stories of this happening to people and I do not want the same thing to happen to you. So please do not risk your business this way. If you currently have any sort of following on any social media platform, aim to get them onto your email list as soon as you can, because that's the smart thing to do. That would protect you completely from any outside force that you have no control over. Because once you have an email list of your followers, it doesn't matter what happens on any platform, you can still contact them. Let's say let's say you have 100,000 followers on Instagram and your account is suspended or Instagram is suddenly banned, hypothetically, for whatever reason, Instagram suddenly closed, shut down, banned, gone forever. If you have those 100,000 followers on your email list also, you could send out an email saying, hey, my Instagram is banned or Instagram has closed down forever. Come and check out my YouTube channel or come and check out my Snapchat or come and check out my my TikTok or come and check out my podcast or my blog or whatever it is, it doesn't matter. You're safe because you have their email address. You can still contact them. You can still sell to them. Your business is safe because no matter what happens, your email list is going nowhere. There is a reason that in order to create virtually any account online, they ask you for an email address. Netflix, Facebook, TikTok, Snapchat, LinkedIn, YouTube, Spotify, Apple Music, Disney Plus, Xbox, PlayStation, I could go on forever. There is a reason they all want your email address because email is the most powerful way to contact your audience online and nobody can ever take it away from you. So now that I've hopefully made the case for you as to why you need to build an email list for your business as soon as possible, let's talk about the best way to do that, in my opinion. It's right here on YouTube. So second to Google, YouTube is the most visited website in the world. The reason for that is because YouTube is basically the video version of Google. They're both owned by the same parent company, which is Alphabet, and they are both the biggest search engines on the planet currently. One is a text format, which is Google, and one is a video format, which is YouTube. YouTube is the how-to place online. If you need to learn how to do something, you come to YouTube. So when your nan needs to learn how to use her new smart TV remote, when your dad needs to learn how to change the rear wiper on his car, when you need to learn how to sell online courses or build a business online, when people need answers and help, there is only one place that they come to and it's right here on YouTube. So when people in your niche head over to YouTube and they type in a question, if they find you and you help them to solve their problem, you've just placed yourself and your business into a prime position to build a relationship up with that person and potentially, potentially sell something to them in the future. The way to do that is by creating helpful content on YouTube that your ideal audience can discover when they are searching for something or if they have already searched for something and YouTube recommends one of your videos to them based upon their previous search history and their watch history. And then once your video is in front of them, they start to watch it, you of course want to deliver value inside of that video that helps them, but you also want to give them a call to action and direct them towards an additional resource that will help them even more. That resource is what we refer to in this business as a lead magnet. A lead magnet is usually a free downloadable resource that somebody can get in exchange for their email address. In every one of my videos, I don't ask people to subscribe to my channel. I don't ask people to like my videos or to share my videos or to leave a comment. I offer them a lead magnet. Now, if you think back to what I offered you at the start of this video, 
do you remember my digital creator startup guide? That's one of my lead magnets for my business. It's a way in which I can give you an additional free resource, which you will no doubt find very helpful if you are interested in my niche and you're trying to sell digital products like online courses or coaching programs. And in exchange for that resource, I get your email address. This is such an easy thing to do when you break it down and simplify it. The goal for your business or for any business is to generate revenue. And in order to do that, you need a consistent stream of new leads coming in every month through the door. Now, regardless of what niche you are in, you already know that YouTube is the how-to place. So if you can make videos that help people to solve problems inside of your niche or your area of expertise, and you put those videos up on YouTube consistently for your ideal audience to discover, when they are looking for help. And then inside of each of those videos, you offer them a free related additional resource, which is your lead magnet. What happens over time, as you build up more and more discoverable videos on YouTube, more and more people will be watching those videos. More and more people will be exposed to your lead magnet offerings. More people will sign up to those lead magnets, which in turn means that your email list starts to grow and continues to get bigger and bigger and bigger as time goes on and as you make more and more videos. And as I've already explained to you, the bigger the email list, especially a targeted email list, which is what you would be building doing this, the bigger that list gets, the more revenue your online business will generate. That is how I am able to grow my email list every single day for free with highly targeted email subscribers. It's not a flashy advertising campaign. It's not a secret strategy. It's very simple. I just show up every week right here on YouTube. I try to create the best videos, helping people just like you to build an online business just like this. And in return, my email list continues to grow, which translates to revenue continuing to grow for my business. That's it. That's how I manage to grow my email list every single day with fresh new leads for my business. And I know that some of you may also be wondering what to do with those subscribers once you have them on your email list. If you want to know that along with everything else that you need to do in order to build a successful online business in this space, then you should simply go ahead and grab yourself a free copy of my Digital Creator Startup Guide, which explains everything for you from start to finish. And you can do that by simply clicking the link that is somewhere up here on your screen now and also down below in the video description. That's all I have for you in this video. I hope you found this helpful and I wish you the very best of luck with building your own email list. Until next time, take care.